What is up guys and welcome to another Red Dead Online video. Today we are talking about other features that Rockstar may go and add to the next Red Dead Online update which is the summer update and hopefully we do not have to wait that much longer to go and see that out. But in the last update, last week's update, they did say this at the bottom of the page. They talked about adding a new way to go and change your character without it affecting your progress and also they talked about changing your offensive and defensive from going from free roam events into missions and then back to free roam events but they also said this implementing some of the top requested features for the next major red dead online update now a lot of people have been asking what are these features and obviously i don't think rockstar are going to announce that until the update is here but that means red dead online will be going to get a lot of stuff that has already been requested by the players that have been playing this now you have to bear in mind the scale of which you have been requested now high will not be a part of this update I can assure you you will not see them as part of this update you may see it in the update after or the following update after that but it will be a highlighted feature as in when they first talk about the update and first announce it they will say heists will be in the next update they haven't done that they've been talking about roles what I'm on about is you'll see stuff a lot smaller the stuff that we're looking at maybe will get connections better to Red Dead Online a lot of you guys still have problems with connecting to Rockstar servers. Every now and then I get disconnected. It's probably for me, I disconnect maybe one every two or three days and then that's it. Some of you guys disconnect hourly. Some of you even disconnect way more than that, which is kind of ridiculous. I would say connection will probably get a bit better. I'm not saying that you will never disconnect again. I'm just saying it will be less regular, but you'll probably still disconnect. Disconnections will always be a thing, no matter what game you're playing. I'm also thinking that for this next update, we might have a chance to have private lobbies. Private lobbies would be one of those things where it's not too hard to go and do it's not exactly easy but it's not hard compared to adding this instead of heist or maybe being able to rob a store just go in there just go and hold your gun up and then ask for money similar to what gta has already got and what gta had from like the first day of gta online camps to get upgraded we already know that's gonna be a thing so i would expect there to be more stuff in the camp maybe for what you guys have been asking for pets within the camp that could very well be a small feature that is added to red dead online stuff like that is not too hard to go and add to the game but it sort of satisfies those that have been asking it because they are very small features maybe a bigger inventory space so upgrading your satchel or even bandolier so you can hold more weaponry as well as bullets so stuff like that is very small and this has also been in the red dead Dead Redemption 2 story. Myself, I want to go and see maybe a new ability card which focuses on hunting and the fact that we've got these new roles coming into play, maybe you can get an ability card for each one that you go through. Say say there's a rank for going through a bounty hunter, also a trader, also a collector. There's different ranks between all three of those. If you progress through that, you go and unlock an ability card for that specific role. That is what I would like to see. You then have stuff like wagons. Wagons is one of those where it's a bit of a maybe. Yes, wagons, you can all already go and get them by stealing them you can already control wagons but where are you going to get the wagons yes you could go to stables and stables are big enough but maybe rockstar want to go and do something completely different where there is a completely different building that you go to get wagons from so you have to go and buy horses from the stables and then go and get wagons elsewhere but wagons could very well fit inside the stable and you could go and buy wagons there a red dead online editor is another thing that i would like to go and see but it's one of those where it's a maybe it is still a fairly big thing to go Go and make an editor where anyone can go and create a race, go and create a deathmatch, anything like that, and then go and submit it so other people can go and play. Once it's sorted, it's just all about adding our assets continuously, making sure it functions correctly, making life a bit easier, different UIs, stuff like that. But it's one of those things where it's maybe it is heavily requested and it would make life so much easier for Rockstar in the future, but it's also one of those where it's just getting it out there in the first place is a big thing. But all the other stuff, like I mentioned, you know the different stuff to do with connection getting camps to be upgraded bigger inventory space private lobbies being able to rob a store upgraded satchels and bandoliers new ability cards all of that stuff is the types of features that I'm expecting to go and see added to Red Dead online because they are fairly small things but
but at the same time they are heavily requested so it's a win-win on either rockstar's part because it's heavily requested so it's doing you guys a favor doing me a favor because i want to go and see him as well as you guys want to go and see him so we're happy on that point and it's not too much work for rockstar to go and do that and make it happen so it's a win-win on both sides if we go and get those things stuff like heist way too big wagons is a maybe as well as a rockstar editor is a maybe anyway this was just a video to go and clear all of those things up but what small features are you looking to go and add to red dead online is it the stuff that i've already said in this video i know i'm missing a lot more these are the ones that i've seen commented on in the previous couple of videos and i know there's going to be so much more so leave them all in the comments down below and i'll say whether or not i think they could be added or whether or not they will not be added and be something bigger in the following updates but leave that all in the comments down below but anyway guys i hope you guys did enjoy if you did enjoy don't forget to leave a like and subscribe but for now i'm going so see ya